Chelsea Market, a bustling food hall in the middle of Manhattan, has vendors serving every kind of food you can imagine. So you might be surprised to hear people are clamoring to stop by a pita spot to eat this, a head of cauliflower. It's fresh, it's lush. The taste is just so great. It is just so great. If you come in once, you're sold. Ms. Known started in Tel Aviv in 2011, and since then they've expanded to Melbourne, Paris, Vienna, and they even opened a restaurant right here in New York in 2018. At its heart, Ms. Known is a pita restaurant, but they've actually built their international fame based on one vegetable, cauliflower. And I know, I know, cauliflower is the most boring vegetable, but at Ms. Known they're doing it a little bit differently. So I cannot wait to see what this restaurant is doing with this relatively boring vegetable to make it an international sensation. Ms. Known is the sister eatery to a series of five-star restaurants owned by celebrity chef Eyal Shanai. You may have never heard his name before, but in Israel, he's a superstar, akin to Gordon Ramsay or Carla Hall. We have him on TV shows. We have him at uh, restaurants in Israel. He is the spirit chef. He talks with the food, actually, and he describes it at, as it has its own soul and spirit, every, every kind of food. But after building a high-end dining empire, he decided to make his food accessible to the masses, and thus emerged this eatery, specializing in exceptionally crafted street food bites. And people around the world couldn't get enough. Well, when we showed up, they showed up, because they definitely wanted to try and see for themselves. I've been in Miss Known in Paris, my first time, and then in Tel Aviv, and now New York. So why are you, if you've been here before, why are you coming in America? Because it's so amazing. What we really focus on is one, great ingredient, but we don't try to overcomplicate things. They just make veggie eatable. I'm sure that little kids would love it too. I love it, and it's good. The prep to create this popular dish is simpler than you might imagine. After boiling, the whole cauliflower head is lightly massaged with olive oil and sprinkled with sea grills, a coarse gray sea salt. Then it's popped in the oven for roasting. Once perfectly tender and lightly charred, cooks douse the veggie with a little more olive oil and sprinkle it with more sea grills. Yep, that's it. I had a few people tell me earlier that the way it eats is like a steak. It has a bite to it that I was not expecting. I feel like when you eat cauliflower normally, it's like embarrassingly crunchy and loud, but if you eat it boiled, there's just no texture to it. Somehow they have managed to give this a texture that is, it both melts in your mouth, but has a nice spring to it that I was not expecting. It has that char flavor, it has a very nice smoky flavor. If you're like trying to go vegetarian, but you really miss meat, you should eat this. This is what cauliflower is when cauliflower believes in itself. It's delicious. And that's why there's a line around the block. And that's why there's a line around the block. Huh.